Somebody asked me the other day about qualifying your clients. It's a really interesting question. I've gotten that one from a lot of people. Hi, it's Bill. It's Creative License, and uh, thanks again for being a part of the little dog and pony show. Uh, excuse me. Um, I want to thank the folks of Electra Voice and Disc Jockey Event Planner, DJN TV, and Promo Only for being great sponsors and great products, too. You should check into all of them. But uh, to get back to the original thing, uh, qualifying your clients. I've had people talk about it. Uh, in here's a, here's, here's a good example. Um, Bill, should I put my prices on my website? I heard that if I put my prices on my website, then the people that can afford me are the only ones that will call me. And I, f I guess if in fact qualifying your clients means finding people that can only pay your price or that finding people that think they can pay your price, then you've qualified them, right? But honestly, I'm trying to, when I qualify my clients, it has to be with some time with them because whether or not they can afford me has very little to do with what they know about what I do and what I know about what they want. That's qualifying for me. I want to spend some time getting to know them and getting to know what they need and then making sure that I can speak to their actual wants, their actual desires, the things that they're really looking for, not the things they say they're looking for, but the things they're really looking for. And then I want to be able to be sure that if I say I have what you want, that I really have what they want. If I'm just renting equipment or if I'm just showing up with what everybody else does, then yeah, I mean, I got to come in to the price that is the same as everybody else. And then somehow I need to look a little different than everybody else. So I'm a little more attractive than the next guy. But if I really want to qualify the people I'm going to work with, I want them to qualify me too. I want them to get some time to understand that I have something so unique that they cannot find it anywhere else. And then I want to be sure that when I say to them, I can do for you exactly what you want, that I can do exactly what they want. And now once I do that qualification, the price is no longer an issue. Because yeah, they had a price they had in mind of the thing that they thought they were buying, but after they get done talking to me, they now know that there's something else in the picture, like nothing that they thought they were looking for. So now they had no idea that what that was gonna cost. So usually the price now becomes irrelevant. If in fact, what they want from me is what I know I can give them, and it is completely unique to the entire marketplace. What do you think of this? Um, tell me if you have some qualifications for your clients. You should have qualifications. I mean, I have a list of things that I'm looking for from my client and how much they can pay way down in the very bottom. <laughs> this is Bill. This is Creative License, and I'll see you next time. Bye.